What's up guys, it's Daddy here from Daddy Texas Today's my predicted lineup for Chelsea versus Arsenal in the Premier League. Let's get into my lineup. So in goal, it has to be Mendy. Unfortunately, Potter did say in his uh, press conference today that Kepa won't play until after World Cup. Right centre back, Trevor Chalobah. He's very, very, very good. Even though he did score the own goal against Brighton, still seems sticking in this place because he's just been really good since the finals been injured. Central centre back, Thiago Silva. He was. Dropped from the last game, not because of his performances, I just think he really needed a rest. Left centre-back, Koulibaly, I thought it was quite solid against Adinobos. Right wing-back, Cesar Aspilicueta. He's literally Arsenal's nemesis right now. The two central midfielders are going to go with Dennis Zakaria as Jorginho. I know you're thinking, why do you think Zakaria is going to start this game? Because Kovacic will be back for this game, Potter did say. But I I want to see Zakaria and Jorginho. Well, that worked again the last game against Adinobos. Left wing back, it has to be Mark Cucurella. Unfortunately, Ben Chilwell is out with a hamstring injury. He'll be out for a while. Luckily, you have Cucurella as backup. The two attacking midfielders, I'm going to go with Mason Mount and Raheem Sterling. Mount got about in the match of the last game against Dinamo. It just he couldn't get any goal contributions, but he was still very good. And on the left, Raheem Sterling scored. Hopefully, he could be back on form now. Hopefully, that goal on Wednesday could give him a bit of confidence. And up front, I'm going to go with Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, who's going to have... Something to say in this game, I hope, against his former club, Arsenal. So let's get us the opposition to sad things. So our opponents, Arsenal, in their last game, they won 1-0 against Zurich in the Europa League with Kieran Tundu scoring. They managed just to breeze through their group. Even though they did lose against PSV in the last round, I think they were already through. In their last five games, they won 5 0 at home to Forest, which is just unbelievable in that game. Before that, they lost 2 0 to PSV. Before that, away from home, they drew 1 1 away to Southampton. Then before that, they won 1 0 against PSV. Then before that, they managed to grind out a 1 0 win away at Leeds. Their top scorer is Gabriel Jesus, who's been a very good signer since joining from Manchester City. Five goals, six assists in 17 games with 251 minutes per goal. His goals have dried up recently, but soon firing once again. A danger player, Bukayo Saka. He's got five goals, five assists in 18 games this season with 251 minutes per goal. When Jesus is not scoring, it's Saka. And those two together have been very good for Arsenal this season, so I'm not surprised that they want to offer him a new contract, even though Chelsea want to try and sign Saka. You know, you can try to sign Saka all you want. I don't see him leaving Arsenal anytime soon. So, guys, my score prediction, I'm going to go with a 2-1 Chelsea win. I see Aspen Laqueta score as he always scores against Arsenal at Stamford Bridge. I see Gabriel Jesus scored for Arsenal to break his goal drought. And Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang to score for Chelsea against Arsenal. So, guys, thanks for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Share with your friends. See ya.